girl Nige, and we are back with another video today we are making sunday dinner um my fiance is at work he is so um he works every sunday that's like a given we know sundays he's gonna be at work he doesn't get out till midnight sorry my kids are really loud uh, loud in the background he doesn't get out till midnight so we won't see him until later on but me and the girls are gonna eat lasagna tonight and i'm gonna take you along on our journey as we cook well i cook they're just gonna be in the background making noise but yeah as i cook this meal so come along let's go now we got the pot boiling okay i'm gonna turn the stove on I'm going to add just a little bit of oil, um, only because I'm about to saute me some frozen veggies. That's my food. Okay, so. You know you gotta put some complete because your meal ain't complete without it. Okay. And I'm gonna put like two dashes of black pepper, a couple dashes. The noodles is almost, the noodle water is almost ready for me to put the noodles in. Check on baby boy and I will be back. Okay, I went and got 
little baby DJ. He's gonna swing while I finish cooking. My boyfriend or fiance, whatever, boyfriend fiance, he is at work until 12 at night till midnight. Um, he left at three. He don't get up till 12. So I'm just cooking for these kiddos. And I am new to being a stay-at-home mom. I'm used to working. Okay, the boiling water is done. We're about to put this lasagna in. These lasagna noodles. You all right, Ocean Rose? What's, what happened? hour shifts so um I barely got to see my kids and I'm sad to say so I am very blessed now that I'm home and I get to spend time with them and cook with them and all right stop being loud baby and you're not gonna do until after you eat okay okay all right you're gonna have to eat okay okay I love you okay so yeah I haven't um you know got to be a stay-at-home mom because you know, I'm a mom of six, the economy is high, but um, when I had, you know, uh, little DeAndre, I told my boyfriend I really didn't want to go to work and I wanted to stay home. All right, baby. Go in there. Mommy's cooking. I don't want you to be by the stove, okay? Okay. Sorry. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. That's my daughter again. She is a mama's girl. Um, but yeah, I didn't want to uh, go back to work if possible, and by the grace of God, um, my boyfriend is able to take care of us, you know, with one income, so I am blessed, you know, I try not to complain too much because he does his big one, um, you know, especially in this economy, like I said. Y'all go watch TV. Coco Melon is on, baby. Uh, it helps me. I help uh, uh, me. Okay, I'm just letting this cook down. So it looks a lot better. It's cooking down. Ah, Smelling good. Stop screaming, Ocean. See that steam nice and hot. And here's the noodles, they're boiling too. Um, that's from um, oh, that's I use the same spoon that I use for my sauce in here, so yeah, it's just residue from the seasoning and stuff. Okay, so guys, the ground turkey is done. It looks still white, but that's because it is white turkey. In person, it's a lot darker than it looks on camera. So I'm gonna add some tomato sauce. Any kind of tomato that you want, tomato sauce, but I'm gonna use this one because I'm making lasagna. So yeah. All right guys, I put two cans of spaghetti sauce. I'm gonna just stir this around. Sorry, I have my ring light, it is charging right now. So I'm just using a flash in my phone. And it's kind of hard because I have DJ in my hand. I got the spaghetti sauce, I got it simmering while i wait for the noodles good question guys are you guys the kind of people that put sugar in your spaghetti sauce or not see me personally i grew up on sugar on spaghetti sauce but i know everybody flavors is different me personally i'm gonna put some sugar in it and call it a day every time so noodles are done stop yelling guys noodles are done we're about to drain them and then get this lasagna started i'm about to preheat my oven to 350 and call it a day um, and we'll make some garlic uh, biscuits on the side. 
for the side salad for the adults my daughters is not going to eat that that's why i try to put some peppers in it so they can get their veggies in because my daughters will not they're still at that age where they're really picky but yeah i'll be back it's um i put a small layer of tomato sauce now we have a small layer of noodles, a little bit of ricotta cheese and some shredded cheese. I shredded my own cheese. I like it way better than the store-bought sheddedness, you know? And while they're playing in the background and I'm trying to get them out, but they're not listening. Anyways, um, we have a big, a thicker layer than the last layer of tomato hey, sauce and um, me. Okay, I put another thing of noodle, more ricotta, and I do um, season my ricotta with a little bit of um, Italian seasoning and black salt. Okay, guys, so I ended up putting the rest of it together. I thought that I had um, actual mozzarella balls like I normally do for my lasagna, but I didn't. So I had some, sh I had like some sliced ones. So I'm just gonna use this for a topper. And I'm gonna let that bake for about 30 to 45 minutes. Maybe uh, watch a little TV and around that time I should be making biscuits and we should be done and ready to eat. So yeah. My oven is a mess, so don't mind it. But we're just gonna check on the food. It is looking good and bubbly and delicious. So until that's done, we're gonna start making our garlic biscuits um so what i do is i melt butter and put it on top of um the biscuits with a little bit of garlic seasoning and it's so good and yeah that's what we're gonna have what's everybody having for dinner um on this good sunday you know this in for about nine minutes don't mind my pan it's just staying but yeah that's how it looks after you put the seasoning in. I put a little bit of Italian seasoning and black pepper too, so yeah. Here's the plate when it's all done. This is my youngest plate. She got the lasagna. The noodles started to break up because I didn't let it cool down. Um, that's her biscuit. And for her sweet treat, for all the kids' sweet treat, I let them get a little bit of strawberries, grapes. I cut them up and I gave them some marshmallows. Okay, the kids are getting antsy. I'm about to put their plates inside of the freezer, let it cool down, let them eat. The girls are getting all antsy, they're ready to eat, so I'm gonna let them eat. I'm going to, I'm not gonna eat right now, I'm not, I'm actually not really hungry right now. So I'm gonna let, you know, them eat, let their food, um, well, I'm gonna let their food cool down, then I'm gonna let them eat. But um, I hope you guys liked my video. Um, I, if you did like my video, can you please, 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 please give me a comment, a like, a subscribe, and you can share it even, you know, like support your girl. I, I love that. Anyways, um, you guys have a good night. I hope you guys have a blessed Sunday and yeah, bye.